You rockin' with Lil Boy Diddy B, man. Voice of the Youth, Taco Talks TV. Taco Talks TV. Yeah. Cool. Taco Talks TV. <laughs> <laughs> Taco Talks TV. Taco Talks TV. Man, young Jose. Rest in peace to swipe and YC. Taco Talks TV. What helped you come out with the title for that? You know what I'm saying? You got WAP and, and almost every mixtape title, but why Slim WAP? For this one. Shit, for real, for real, my motherfucker. That was some last minute shit, for real, but but like motherfuckers called me, motherfuckers be calling me some wild shit, I don't know, like yeah. this. Slim Rich, that's what my tape was originally gonna be called. I was gonna call it you know, Slim Rich. I know some fans and all that shit was like confused. Like I was promoting Slim Rich, the mixtape yeah. coming on and all that, but yeah. what they don't know is uh through my uh what I look through distro kids, so like on that shit right there, that's what I went through too yeah. as well. So his AKA is Slim Rich on there. Yeah. So they thought I was trying to like put out oh, music as like him yeah. or something like but yeah. no, like, that was what that wasn't what it was, so I just had to change it. I just put a combination of my name and his name, Slim Rich. Hell yeah. Slim Wop. That's what I was thinking. Yeah, and that's he was about to change, he was about to switch that baby out shit and all that too, because a lot of motherfuckers are all like Charlie C, biggest shit ain't yeah, that baby yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I told bro like that too. Yeah. Baby yeah. out for <laughs> heavy yeah. shit though. Um, I was also going to say, like, how you put that track list together? Because I know most times people will record endless and then go through and pick certain shit out, or did you just record with the intention that these songs was for the tape? Shit, nah. Like, like, um, I had like two, or, like two or three songs I had did before. Before I even got in college, already, because I was just recently in college when I got on a march. Yeah, for real, I did a little three month bed. That shit went nothing. Uh, I did that shit. I, I had recorded like two or three songs that I put on the tape um, before I got in college or whatever. So, like, that shit really was just like the song that I really fucked with for real. Yeah. Like, I really thought that, like, I, I really hadn't really put meaning behind that shit for yeah. real. Like, every song that I had done for real. Hell that shit, that, that, that whole album, man, that shit was for my bro, bro. So, yeah, yeah, look, that was that was the next thing I was gonna say. Like, it's like you could hear Baby Out presence on every song. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, I played the joint, I turned Slim Wild One, and I just put it on shuffle and let it play for like three hours. You know what I'm saying? So I could really get in tune. Time, yeah, get in tune with everything that's going on. But, you, you know what I'm saying? I'm looking at the game here in the joint play. And you hear baby out even if he not even on the song, you know what I'm saying? Not on some bite in the flow. Nah, but you, I already nah I know exactly what you mean, cause yeah. like I didn't see anything on the comments on my videos and shit, like motherfuckers would be like, yeah. Like like this like bro that I didn't really see like this shit, you can go in my comments right now, like, yeah. my Instagram shit on my snip in my video, motherfuckers like, yeah, you ain't I know baby I ain't looking down at you cause he right next to you. Hell yeah. You never do you I can hear him. I didn't hear him in your voice right now. Like, yeah. you know, first, I didn't hear all oh, baby out for that shit. That's only because that, that's real loud. My, that's my brother, bro. Like, yeah. You hear me? Yeah, yeah they got him and all that, bro. So we used to rap to each other every night, all that, bro. Everything we did was like, I was just like that nigga for, for real. So I did, I did with that nigga. Respect. With, with all the shit surrounding baby out, like, how have you been? You know what I'm saying? Just as. As Boo Wop, as Lil Wop, Slim Wop, you know what I'm saying? As a person moving around and shit, like, I know that shit hurt, but is it something that you focus on or you use it more as a progressive kind of thing? Yeah, I, mean, I use that shit more like, as I'm trying to just like, yeah, trying to yeah, progress forward, like you said, you know, like persevere. Yeah. This shit called perseverance. Hell yeah. You feel me? Like, like my song, what that was, my second song when I jumped, Storm and shit, that's what, I, that's what I really tapped into on that song for real right there, like when I hooked out to their ass, I lost my book, can I keep moving? When I said I lost my book, can I keep moving? Cause I gotta keep this shit going, you feel me? Yeah. Like, that shit real loud. Like, I just gotta keep that shit going, like, see, like, God forbid if the situation, like, if I had died, like that, like, you feel me? And he was alive, that nigga wanna, he wanna be out here like fucked up all that. Yeah. Like, like he gonna be fucked up all that shit like mentally and emotionally, but he wanna let nigga see that shit though. Yeah. Like and that's that's something we talk, you know, like can't let niggas see can't let niggas pick me up, like fuck him, can't let nobody like pick me up. 
Hell yeah. I was gonna get to that too. Like, like as far as like, I know that in the streets, most niggas be having like PTSD, you know what I'm saying? Going through shit that's a post-traumatic stress disorder. You know what I'm saying? Flashbacks or some street shit that I have or some wild shit. And niggas will fuck around and get depressed. And just like overall in the black community, my experience is that like people neglect that shit. You know what I'm saying? You think that's more helpful or hurtful? Shit, that shit like, nah, what, what, what you mean like, like that? Like, like just not acknowledging the pain or not really like properly dealing with it. You know what I'm saying? That shit, that shit hurtful, bro. I ain't even hold you. Like, okay. you can't bother that shit up, bro. Like, like you go, like the motherfucker that you, you, you go to chill with every day, you be with every day, I mean, that you live with or something. Hey, you yeah. find them or something like whoever you love close to you for real, but like you go from living an everyday life with that person to that shit just like it's bad. It's like that person that didn't know more. Like I get real life, like I be thinking like my mood changes like every day, like I don't know, right? But it's like that one thought that come across my mind and like Take that shit, yeah, like half of the day my shit be like I didn't I don't even be like for real for real, but like if I'm going, if I'm in that state right there, bro, you ain't even gonna see me or nothing, bro. Like, my fucking not gonna you don't know what I'm going. My fucking not gonna know what I'm going. My fucking might see my tweets or something. Nah, you don't know what I'm going through. Yeah. Like, like I don't really show that shit for I don't, I don't, I really don't say nothing for real, for real. So, like, that little shit I do be saying, nah, that's, that's don't be nothing for real. That's the yeah. shit that I'm worried about for real. Like, yeah. Respect. Um, do you believe in destiny? Hell yeah. And, and, and to what extent, like, you gotta explain to me, like, what you feel like destiny is to you? I mean, yeah, like, I'm glad you broke that shit down, too, because, like, I'm a, I'm a Muslim man, so, like, I, yeah, I practice Islam, so, like, I don't believe in no, no luck shit or nothing. Yeah, nothing yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah. So, when you that, I just believe, like, Allah has a plan for everybody. Like, yeah. You feel me? You think you're on the right path so far? Because, like, I recently heard somebody say that. When when man plans, God laughs, or even Allah laughs. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So like, um, yeah. What you mean, like on the right path? Or, or like, as far as what you're doing, like, do you doubt what you're doing that you're not gonna be successful, or you, or you got the vision and the plan that this is going, you know, take off? No, I don't. I don't doubt none of that shit. Like, they, I don't doubt none of that shit. Like, it can happen, and it can, it can happen, and it can't. Family, so like one day I could blow up or I could just be doing this for years and, and not happen. Hell yeah. You feel me? But like, but like, um, with the I think I'm doing good though right now though, cause like with, with my progression, like every video I do or, or every new song I drop and all that, motherfuckers tell me like you getting better. I, I can hear that you getting better. Like hell hey, yeah, so like me, you're proud. My engineer. My uh, my engineer, I'm fucking with Wack right now. Like, shout out Wack, bro. Shout out Wack, man. Wack on the track. He he actually exactly introduced my whole take for everything. Record every song I got on the tape for, except for the tone. Like, except for the tone. Like, 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 you know what I'm saying? That you could think of right now. Not quitting, but you know what I'm saying? Or even if it is quitting, like, is there anything that you think will make you start rapping? No, I'm always good at shit. Hell yeah. I'm always good at shit for, for out. Yeah. I'm always good at shit. <coughs> I, I actually like it. For me, you know? I really like <coughs> I like playing with words and shit. And like, Hell yeah. like when I rap, I really be like reading and shit, watching TV. Yeah. TV content and that so and like, like that comment shit that everybody watch for like shit that motherfucker can relate to for yeah, like tapping and hit the ball like, all that little funny shit new shit that be going on and all that just, like, like put all that shit together and try and make that shit and try and make that shit sound different and all that in the same way and try to keep my personality so yeah. it, of course it was for a different reason but it blew up to a whole different level yeah. did you see like plans like that with with Goon, with Dude, you know what I'm saying? Any of the niggas that you've been around, or is it just more so street shit and not really music shit? Yeah, it means it just be street shit, not any like music shit, but like all that shit that be happening and all that, I swear, but like, them niggas that tell you themselves, like that shit just be happening, like, 
motherfuckers that go rap shit and pay your son, and then it's just back to living life like the rest of the day. Like, nigga don't even be worried about this or nothing. Like, and he probably be on the ground or something. Yeah. Yeah. Shit. Keep us up. Like, yeah. Some of them are some, but like, yeah. That really ain't too much important to y'all. You know what I'm saying? It's every day. Shit, nah, I can't say that though, but like, but like, yeah, it's just like, it be like, I, like, it be other shit. Like, it's like, it's like niggas still, niggas still be out here for real, but like, some niggas still be out here for real, so like, it just be like, worrying about like, other shit more than that, for real, but like, nah, niggas do worry about that too, though, because like, yeah, yeah. you can't, if you try to brand yourself, you can't say you're not trying to keep up with it or pay attention to what's going on. Or try to like enhance it or make it better, you feel me? So like, motherfucking devil. Yeah, motherfucking shit though. Niggas do be like talking to each other and each other like, all right, like tips and shit. I like tips, but, like, you know how everybody. Yeah, everybody like, like, points for the right direction. Right. They need to go grab this or something. Yeah, yeah. They sweep the devil on that or something. They need to go grab these down to Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. motherfucking. I don't know if you get it from art or if it's you or it's just who y'all be around or growing up or whatever. But y'all be fly as shit, you know what I'm saying? Comments, they got song yeah. down. Yeah. Supreme, that shit that I rock, you know what I'm saying? You don't really see too many rap niggas and shit like that, you know what I'm saying? They got different swag, you know what I'm saying? But y'all be taking the day with the yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What's yeah. something like, like, what inspired that? Like, what attracted the high fashion to y'all, you know what I'm saying? Because most, most niggas in the streets don't really, well, not now, but I don't know. Most niggas don't really, Pay attention to high fashion like that. You know what I'm saying? Niggas will go buy some drip, some cool shit, but y'all really be having pieces. Yeah, for the yeah, exactly. But um, shit like ever since I was a young, <laughs> ever since I was younger for real, like my aunt, my uncle for real, they always kept me like taking me to the mall, trying to get some flashes for real. <laughs> yeah. And niggas in the animal like war, trying to <coughs> Trying to that flash it for real. Motherfucking, but uh, I just, uh, I just like, mm -hmm, I just like, I don't know, bro. Everything they used to buy me, bro, like, I used to, that shit used to be like place to to me and all that for us. So, like, that shit just came naturally for real. I just yeah. say, like, how nigga used to, I don't know, motherfucker, that look at a nigga weird or something, like, a nigga, like, yeah, nah, nigga, was definitely hating with a dog and then a dog and a dog and, a dog and shit, like, yeah, my folks just trying to keep me on that flat shit, but like, I ain't gonna lie, it did come to the time where like, what? I'm not gonna say like, in the middle, I'm not middle school, like, like what that was, probably like my seventh grade, seventh, eighth grade, yeah, for real, like, shit got hard for real, like, that shit wasn't even coming as natural no more yeah. for us, so like, nigga feet start going, I mean, the prices start going up on shit, like, yeah. my folks <laughs> wasn't able to get that shit. Yeah, that's when you start getting yeah, to it yourself. Hell yeah, 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 I know what that's like. Yeah, Niggas watching this shit know what that's like. like. Yeah, like, ain't nothing privileged about this shit. I'm not even feeling like, yeah. I don't got it. I got that shit out of my mind.